Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I have a little something that I want to show you guys and it involves the 2020 through 2022, I do believe, um, Super Duties. And it's dealing with the fuse box that is under the passenger side cowl. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. So this is actually TSB 232123 and it was updated August 21st of last year. And it supersedes 22, 24, 43 um, to update the service procedure. And it's saying the 2020 through 2022 uh, Super Duty vehicles may exhibit the engine won't shut off or to have various electrical concerns, uh, including dead battery, the horn stays on, no crank, no start. Like I said, the engine won't shut off. It may also have illuminated ABS indicator with diagnostic trouble code C0020 and a U3003 in the ABS module. And the truck that I'm working on is a 2020 and it does have both of those codes actually. And what we got to do is replace that box. And I will show you the box and I'll give you the part number. Okay, old box, new box, old lid, new lid. It goes down there. Um, new old box it gets corrosion and stuff up in here it gets moisture inside of it old lid black new lid gray why I don't know don't ask there's the new box so I'm gonna put that box down there and the part number For the new fuse panel, LC3Z14A068 Alpha. That is a fuse box, also known as the battery junction box. And that's the part number for the lid, LC3Z14A003 Delta. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can do this one handed. These are two seven millimeter nuts. That is your positive for that positive cable right there. They screw in. Not nuts, bolts, excuse me, see? They screw in to those right there. You have to be very careful putting this in. So I'm going to do this one-handed. All right, there's that. Start it with your fingers. Not have to be super duper tight. And that right there is a 10 mil. Now, we want to put the lid on there so it seals like that. 
Sometimes these things will be off a little bit and you get some moisture down in there. So get my new updated lid. And it locks into the corner like so. Push it down. So we are covered everywhere. And it's in. And this is not programmable. You don't have to program it. You just disconnect the batteries. Take this one out. That one over there is disconnected. Pull the airbox, or take the battery out, pull the battery tray out, which is just 13, 13, 13, and a 13. And then you'll just disconnect this ground cable, which is that guy. And that one is a eight mil. So I'm gonna get all this put back together, but that's, this is the culprit. Usually if you get those symptoms, uh, appreciate it. I love you guys. See you on the next one.